There are two main ways in which we can tell whether BAF2 is ionic or covalent. This is barium fluoride. So the first way is we can look at the periodic table divided into metals, metalloids, and nonmetals. So barium is right here, it's a metal, and fluorine over here, it's a nonmetal. When we have a metal and a nonmetal, we'll have usually an ionic compound. Another way we can do this is we can look at the electronegativity values for each element, for the barium and the fluorine. So here we have barium, that's 0.89, and over here, fluorine. So 3.98 for the fluorine minus 0.89, that's 3.09. That's the difference in electronegativity between barium and fluorine. If we look at this diagram here, we can see if the electronegativity difference is greater than 2.0, we have an ionic compound. So just like we found looking at the metal and the nonmetal, this also shows the difference of 3.09, that's greater than two, that barium fluoride, BAF2, is an ionic compound. This is Dr. B answering the question whether BAF2 is ionic or covalent. It is an ionic compound. Thanks for watching.